today I'm testing to see how long it takes for my screen to go into idle mode and turn off. I'm going to start it right now. I think it's going to take around probably a little over five minutes. They say it should take six minutes and right now it's not plugged into anything. <laughs> Can I see the phone, please? said this was possibly already cracked open both of these eggs so she thinks this one's a bad egg also the living ones when she was boiling it these were already floating which is not good i guess when you put an egg into a bunch of water just use down water it shouldn't float but these were floating so i'm gonna go peel this and we'll come back once i've peeled both of these and see what they look like I really hate wasting food, you can tell. I can't smell it. Um, so let me peel the, these two.
So it actually just went into what do you call it? Sleep mode around 5:20, 5:30. I'm going to. My kid's gonna sneeze. I'm gonna bring back the display and stop recording. So that was around I think five minutes and thirty seconds. I was watching from afar because I was doing a different video over there. So when it's not plugged in, it's around five minutes and thirty seconds. I can try it again. We go try it again, okay? Starting again. Let's see how I was surprised. I didn't think this would work because I'm screen recording. I thought the screen record would have stopped it from going into idle. So these are my two eggs. This one was the white egg. This was the brown egg. I'm gonna break it just for display purposes. My wife told me not to eat these eggs. And in the past, I would, uh, this is the brown egg. In the past, I wouldn't care and I would still eat it, but now that I'm older, I know not to do as many stupid things in my life, like eat moldy bread or eat food that's been around for three weeks. And the last thing I need is to get really sick. So, floating egg, floating egg. Also, this one looked like it was already cracked. And you, when I was peeling it, or if you watch the video again, you'll see that it's kind of small. Like, I wonder why it's so small. Because I don't know. So, final conclusion: I'm gonna have to throw these eggs away, which I feel really bad. Have a good day. Over and out. Maybe there's another way to tell if it's bad eggs, like the color. I don't feel like googling it. I'm just tired. I just wanted to show these eggs that are supposedly bad because they're floating. I'll provide a link to that egg video if you want to watch it. Um, it's just basically me unshelling an egg that was boiled and my wife said not to touch it because when she first put it into the pot of boiled water it wasn't it didn't drop to the bottom it was floating so my wife had told me this before but I think I'm gonna remember now that if an egg is floating in water it probably means it's not good like it's a bad egg. So we're hitting on three minutes. Uh, I'll tell you when it goes into sleep because I can't be sure what happens when it goes into sleep mode. Like what happens to display for the recording. I can only tell you when it actually happens. We're hitting into three minutes. Um, going to have some water here. I could be doing something more important, but I just, this should be an easy Google. I tried Googling it and a lot of third party people mentioning what it should be, but Google should put it on their actual OS displayed, like timeout would happen in five minutes or eight minutes, but it doesn't. So I'm willing to test this. No one else is going to test this out of the 400 or 600 million people in the United States, I will test it myself because I'm a tester. But I'm waiting, just waiting for it to happen. We're hitting on to four minutes now. Well, you can see watching the display like me probably. Uh, another thing I'll be trying out soon is my son asked me to play Minecraft recently. Um... I got this kid who's really sick 
that's coming up to me so I can wipe his nose. I'm going to do that. You can probably hear him in the background sniffling. Blow it, blow it. Good job. We're hitting four minutes and 35 seconds. Hoping, hoping my theory was right. It's about five minutes and 30 seconds when it goes to screen timeout. That's my theory because I saw it once, I think. But I could be wrong. It's not the first time I've been wrong. We're hitting five minutes. Um, and I've been saying it's five minutes. Okay, now he wants cereal. Just wait 30 seconds so I can verify what happens here. Uh, hopefully you saw that the screen dimmed. Maybe it won't show it on the, what's it called, actual recording but it just dimmed at five minutes and we're hitting five minutes and 26 27 and now it's out I'm not sure if you can see that but uh, my screen right now is totally out so around 525 526 the what do you call it screen went out completely and I'm gonna bring it back So that's the conclusion of my video. I'll just put it in the title so you can just know that it's that's how long it takes to do screen timeout. It might be different by different computer. I'll also post the computer that I'm using and you can make your decisions. Uh, I don't have my adapter with me, but I'll try to go get it and give it a try right now. Now just put it in the description. You don't have to watch like a eight minute video to figure out how long the screen timeout is when it's plugged in. Over and out.